This is a trillion dollar business. Less than 1% of the licenses right now go to African Americans and Latinos. The new BET documentary, Smoke, sheds a light on the systemic racial issues embedded in our society when it comes to Black America and the war on drugs. Here to chat a little bit more about the film is Cook County State's attorney, Kim Fox. Miss Kim Fox, like I said, thank you so much for joining us. Let's dive right into the conversation. This is narrated, executive produced by rapper Nas, and it takes a deep dive into what this industry really is. Yeah, it looks at the history of the war on drugs, particularly as it relates to marijuana, um, and the role of the criminal justice system in prosecutions and convictions that literally devastated many communities. And it highlights the work that we've done here in Illinois around marijuana legalization uh, and the vacating of convictions. 4.3% of dispensaries are currently black owned. What can we do as a community, as, as leaders are watching this perhaps, to get those numbers up a little bit? Well, first we have to recognize that that number is too small and that for all of the devastation that the war on drugs caused, that it is only right that we have greater minority participation. And during this pandemic, marijuana, legal marijuana usage has um, skyrocketed and generated millions and millions of dollars. And so I think we have to demand um, as a public that that money goes back into the communities that have been devastated um, and say that it is insufficient for the numbers to be what they are right now. What do you hope people learn or gain from this uh, documentary? Yeah, I hope we do a deep dive into the history of marijuana usage as a country and the devastating, again, impact that the war on drugs has had on Black and brown communities and a sense of optimism of how we can right the wrongs of the past and how we can make sure that communities that have been disinvested in are part of the solution and the answer. And so uh, I think it's gonna be very informative and, and a call to action to make sure that our systems are fair and equitable. State's Attorney, when we talk about this election, whether it is um, national, whether it is local, women in general had a super powerful voice. You know, How do we keep this momentum going? Because as, as the years go by, we have to make our voices heard. You know, I think we have to just keep our foot on the gas. You know, uh, Senator Kamala Harris, Vice President-elect, is in this documentary as well. And I think she serves as inspiration to how far women can go. Um, and you look at women like Stacey Abrams, who helped flip Georgia. Um, and it is demonstration of the role that women must play in our democracy to move us forward. And so I think we celebrate these wins and then we recruit more women uh, to get in and run for office. It is a deliberate effort to make sure we ask more women to run. And speaking of women in office, this will be your second term as state's attorney. What's, what's one thing that you want to focus on uh, in the coming years that you're like, hey, I want to change this. I want to keep working toward this. You know, our work around mental health. Far too many people who come into our criminal justice system are struggling with issues of mental health and the lack of resources in communities to deal with these issues um, is really having a toll on not just our justice system, but on families. And so we wanna work with partners in the community to address mental health head on um, and deal with it in our communities and not in our criminal legal system. Absolutely. State's Attorney Kim Fox, thank you so much for joining us. For more information about the film Smoke, head over to BET.com. And to keep up with all the work State's Attorney Kim Fox is doing and her team, of course, head over to CookCountyStatesAttorney.org.